Welcome back. It's a holiday classic, but with some new elements this year. Orlando Ballet gearing up for its production of Nutcracker and New Six Anchor. Crystal Moyer is giving us an insider look at the production that has the dancers pulling all the strings. Yeah, the dancers serve different roles in the Nutcracker. I'm taking you behind the scenes to show you how the puppeteers bring the toys to life during the show. The story of the Nutcracker is this doll coming to life. So this kind of establishes the toy aspect of it first. And then the lunge into the, the death kill. And then I love this part where he has this kind of death rattle. Oh, and then down. One last look. Very comical. Puppeteer Tony Witten has about 30 years of experience having worked at local theme parks. He now teaches dancers here at Orlando Ballet how to pull the strings. Like a standard marionette, we have a string on the head. We have two each for the legs and two each for the arms to help control. But for these puppets, because they're sword fighting, we have an extra movement right here, just a little thumb bar, and that makes the swords come up and down. Tell me what goes into training to be able to work some of these puppets during the show. Well, it's interesting is that most of them have never done actual puppetry before, so it's just getting used to the weight and the, the scale of these new puppets. Uh, for instance, they have to hold their hands fairly high, uh, and that's an unusual position to hold for a long time. Orlando Ballet Presents The Nutcracker was reimagined by artistic director Jordan Morris with new costumes and choreography. This new version debuted last year. Jordan designed the ballet that it would be kind of a warm and inclusive and exciting and we think it should be part of your tradition. It's part of our tradition. This year, the show includes new animatronics and larger puppets that interact with the audience, like the Flying Goose. It's got these wings that flare out. We have these wonderful little tail feathers, and then we've got this wonderful mechanism on the head here that gives her that kind of birdism where she looks around. It's very, very simple. It's just rods and strings, but when it's done right in the hands of a talented performer, we believe that it's a goose on the loose. Four dancers train as puppeteers and rotate throughout the nearly 30 performances of The Nutcracker, a show that is sure to be on point. The Orlando Ballet presents The Nutcracker at the Dr. Phillips Center for Performing Arts on select days December 6th through the 22nd. I posted all the ticket information on clickorlando.com insider. In the studio, Crystal Moyer getting results new six.